Buy things online? We may have the answer for you. Bitcoin ATMs, and for the first time, they're popping up around Kansas City. We found one today in Overland Park. Okay, we are here with Bitcoin Beamer. First off, tell us what a Bitcoin is. Bitcoin pretty much is just a virtual currency. It's an online way, it's an electronic way to, to pay for goods and services. And why would somebody want one? Various reasons. A lot of people, when they buy stuff online, they want the convenience of you know, being able to send something anonymously. They don't want to give out their credit card details, especially if they're ordering something internationally or things like that. It's many so, reasons. So you have one of the very first Bitcoin ATMs in Kansas City. What's the point of this? Well, you know, a lot of people, you know, they, they go online and they Google, you know, what is a Bitcoin and, and they find out that they need to get this digital wallet. And in order to, to get Bitcoin, you have to, you have to buy it somewhere. So this is literally like an ATM machine. If you want to buy Bitcoins for your digital wallet, you have to either know somebody that has it or come to an ATM. And how does it work? Basically, it's simple. It's, it's a several step process. You just touch to begin here. You just touch the screen and it's, it's going to ask you for the QR code of the wallet. As you guys know, QR codes are around everywhere now. And you literally pull the QR code. Usually people bring in their cell phone of their wallet and they put it right there where the camera is and it scans it. And then you type how much you, you'd like to buy in Bitcoin. You feed the machine and then it transfers you the Bitcoin just like that. And you actually have people using this? And we have it every single day. It's the new trend, and that machine is at We Buy Gold at 151st and 69 Highway in Overland Park. There are a few others around town as well. You can buy Bitcoins online, too, but the process is much more difficult than buying them at an ATM. Very interesting. Hosting the Super Bowl, is it really worth the cost?